What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Marcellos Wilder, Deontay Wilder. Get this. Deontay Wilder's brother, Marcellos, has launched a tirade against him on social media, revealing Deontay has repeatedly betrayed him in the past seven years and then cheated on his wife by having affairs with Marcellos' long-term ex-girlfriend, his girlfriend until recently of the last three years, along with multiple other exes. Hmm. Let me counterpunch. Um, I heard this before, maybe last year sometime. I, I, I avoided it because I'm like, okay, it's not really big enough you know, to talk about, or especially like if you heard it once, you didn't know how accurate it was, but I'll tell you, this is what I will tell you about what happened years ago. Okay. I'm not sure about the exes or all that other stuff. I'm not sure. You know, I mean, uh, I don't know if that's true. I can tell you this though. There was definitely brotherly rivalry there. It was. And you can tell from the side of Deontay Wilder, not necessarily not necessarily Marcellos, simply because Marcellos really didn't, he didn't really have a lot to say about anyone. You know, he had his rivalry with Tommy Fury back in the day, and that really went anywhere. That went nowhere, simply because, you know, he, he kept getting beat. You know, I think he's been beaten twice now, maybe three times, but that's okay. So is Wilder. However, you know, we didn't really hear from him, but... We did hear from Deontay Wilder. And what Deontay Wilder said was, years ago, he was talking about going down to cruiserweight division and compete down there. And the first thing I thought of was like, why are you going to cruiserweight to fight at cruiserweight? And while your brother's at cruiserweight, you know, and I made the comparison between him and his brother and Vladimir Klitschko and Vitaly Klitschko being brothers. And how they would never fight each other and how, you know, they respected each other and, and, and how my Wilder brothers don't have that same relationship. OK, I know that as much, you know, but other than that, um, I don't know of any rivalry that I could remember. I do remember Wilder saying that, you know, he was real competitive with his brother, you know, and you can tell, you know, they're both um, physically uh, gifted guys, you know, they have a, a certain amount of athleticism they are blessed with, you know, from genes, you know, uh, I don't know how skinny Marcel Marcellos's legs is, you know, he might take the cake, hopefully he does, but that may be hereditary as well, but you can tell they're bothly massively big, big dudes, and you get the worst type of rivalry, competitiveness, when you're dealing with brothers, I have brothers myself, and you know, with one of my brothers in particular, it, it's almost like a Cold War all the damn time. So, yeah, it does happen. You know, yeah, there's love there. But there's also this element that I don't think that necessarily needs to be there. And that's that. Now, back to this particular um, topic of him sleeping with exes. You know, I, I don't you know, like that type of stuff there, man. If that's true, that's foul. You know, but it happens, you know, but um, but the past seven years, you know, him cheating on his wife by having affairs with Marcellos' long term ex-girlfriend and he's letting that out. That means he wants that information to come out in order to hurt Deontay. You know what I mean? So like the thing is, is the information that he's letting out about Deontay actually true or is it something formed as a weapon to hurt his brother? You know what I mean? Is this his way of, okay, I'm going to fix you. You know, let me uh, start a smear campaign about you because I am not the popular Wilder. And that could always be the case as well. You know what I mean? But I, I, I say this, those guys that, you know, because you don't hear from Marcellos, you don't hear Wilder talk about Marcellos a lot either. You know what I mean? I remember when he got defeated, I think the night that Wilder fought someone because he ended up fighting on his undercard. You didn't really hear a lot about him and he dismissed the whole thing. Um, but I think it's a shame. I think, you know, I think they should at, at, one, at some point grow up. But sometimes 
that doesn't really happen. If they've been rivals for years, they're going to keep rivals until one of them drops dead. And then even after death, they'll probably still be thinking of who was better than who. You know, we don't know who started it here. Because again, I got a, I have an older brother and it always seems like, dude, are you trying to compete with me on every possible occasion? <laughs> you know, so, you know, those type, type of things happen. But, you know, um, I, I think though, they have to be careful on how they go about it, you know, you know, because you don't want this to turn fatal over, you know, messing with people's exes and stuff like that. You know, I, I don't think that I don't, I don't think it should be that deep, but it can get that deep. And then, in fact, it might have got that deep, you know, but um, but but if there's any solace to any of this to Marcellos to Deontay, I think they should look at brothers that actually get along and mirror what the hell they're doing. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Marcelo's Wilder posting this about his father. Now it wasn't on his, uh, wasn't on his IG account or anything, but this is allegedly what Marcelo's is posting about his brother, Deontay Wilder. Of course, please subscribe and you guys been counterpunched. Peace.